the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. I pray for the body of Christ. Lord, I pray particularly for our precious generation. We thank you for stretching your hand so mighty upon us. Thank you for the apostolic across Nigeria, Africa and the world. Thank you for the prophetic. Thank you for the evangelistic. Thank you for entrepreneurs. Lord, you have raised this generation. You have granted us access to high level, never seen before dimensions of spiritual illumination. You have given us the eyes to be able to see the mistakes of the generations past to see the scars even of the fathers and lord you have granted us the stamina the discipline and the grace to make adjustments and now you have brought out of us a dexterous generation in the similitude of the rich young ruler man of speed man of might man of wisdom man of understanding men of skill men who are even eternity driven but lord i pray like you have revealed to us tonight this one thing that we still lack this one thing that we still lack that desire to love you sincerely the desire to live our lives and be motivated by the desire to see you glorified and the desire to love humanity and to extend our life to impact someone one life and one destiny at a time we pray that this one thing we lack by the help of the spirit may our generation not miss it Amen. lord we thank you for the fathers who have mentored us and continue to mentor us we thank you for the saints and the patriarchs dead and alive men who have opened up their scars and their wounds we have seen their mistakes we have seen their shortcomings you have granted us the grace to climb upon their sacrifices to where we are today we stand before you jesus like the rich young ruler and we confess that there is this one thing that we lack our heart condition alongside our desire to submit to the leadership of the holy spirit we repent oh god as a generation we repent as a people we repent as men of god we repent as business people we repent as kingdom leaders we repent and we cry and ask you by your mercies by the covenant of eternal mercy that you had with david in the name of jesus we pray show our generation mercy may we not miss it in the name of jesus and lord i pray for every man of god every woman of god every captain of industry politician a person of influence i pray in the name that is above all names grant us a grace to be able to fulfill that which you mandated the rich young ruler to do what he could not do may our generation do we declare afresh our love for you jesus we declare before the nations from nigeria to the ends of the earth across africa europe the united states and all the other continents we declare that we are a people who are motivated by our love for you we declare that we are a people who truly desire the entire scope of our lives and our pursuit is to see jesus glorified and then oh god we declare 
that we love the brethren we declare that we love the body of Christ we declare that we love this nation we declare that we love Africa we declare that we love the world and Lord we obtain grace from you to spend our lives impacting lives becoming voices of hope voices of healing voices of deliverance voices of prophecy voices of salvation in the name of Jesus thank you for tonight for in the mighty name of Jesus Christ we pray and I declare over you you are blessed by the power that raised Christ from the dead every key of the kingdom that you need to access to rise to the position of rest round about I declare your eyes find access to that light hear me for anyone here who is still suffering spiritual bankruptcy financial bankruptcy you have not yet learned the ways of the spirit you have not yet mastered the laws of life that elevate men to positions of value and relevance i pray for you by the power that raised christ from the dead that the same grace that raised that young man to become a rich young ruler may that same grace open you up to the keys of the kingdom and for those that god has helped to attain unto a position of stature and grace commanding fearful results already across the nation i pray for you that in the name of jesus christ you will seek jesus like the rich young ruler sought him and that when you find him the final prayer i pray for those who have found him and value his presence so much that you will not waste your time and the value of his presence but that you will allow his presence to change your heart you will allow his presence to cultivate within you the desire to submit to the ministry of the Holy Spirit I bless you and I declare that this week for you is a week of blessings it's a week of recovery it's a week of increase it's a week of enlargement in the name of Jesus because your heart is stayed upon the Lord may he open to you the treasures of greatness may he open your ears and your eyes to see and hear in the name of Jesus Christ I bless you with the blessings of heaven may the blessings speak over your life I pray for your prayer life greater fire I pray for your word life greater fire I pray for your passion for the things of God greater fire but I pray that your motivation will ever be Jesus and nothing less, nothing more. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And everything you desire to see God do in your life this week, I release my faith with you. Return with testimonies. For in the mighty, the matchless, and the blessed name of Dearly beloved, I hope you were blessed by this message. I want you to keep doing something for this man of God, our man of God, Apostle Joshua Salmon. And that is, I want you to keep on praying for him that the cause of the gospel may have free flow in him, that he may be granted boldness to continue with his commission of Jesus Christ and that all provisions be given unto him as he continues in this journey of Christianity. And then don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you are new here. Don't also forget to leave a comment in the comment section and then keep sharing, keep sharing abroad and let's all keep sharing Jesus. I'll see you again. Bye.